hi friends welcome back in this video we will see complete setup for maven projects and how to run the first program in maven projects so let's start it to create the maven project very first step is installation of java and eclipse in last video i already covered how to install java and eclipse link is in description you can go there and see how to install the java and eclipse now we will create the selenium java project so uh, go to your eclipse and go to file then click on new then click on java projects give any name to your projects and keep other all setting defaults and click on next and click on finish if any pop-up comes like create new model then you can uh, click on don't create and click on finish so as this way we have created the selenium java projects now in third step we can convert this selenium java project into selenium maven projects for this right click on your project then click on configure then click on convert to maven projects here in group id you can uh, enter your company name or your group name then in artifact id you can enter selenium java in version you can enter any versions and in packaging you can keep it as jar and rest of the setting you can keep it as default and now click on next and finish so now your maven project is created to verify is maven project is created or not uh, go to the your project and see the form.xml file is appearing here and this is a very important file your all dependencies will be stored in this file in pom.xml files now in fourth step we can add the required dependencies from maven repository so go to your browser and search for maven repository and click on enter then click on this first link now you are redirected to the maven repository now search on selenium java scroll down and uh, and below you find this dependencies so copy this dependency and now go to your projects in your project click on form.xml file and add this dependence copied dependencies in between these two tags and then save it to verify these dependencies are present or not go to maven dependency folders and check the jars are present or not for selenium java if you are unable to find the jars then you can go to the project and click on build automatically and check in maven dependencies jars are present or not so these are the second way if in first way you are unable to find the jar files then you can click on build automatically then your jar files you you can view the all the jar files in the maven dependencies so as this way we can add the selenium java dependency in our maven project now in the fifth step we can add the test engine dependencies to our maven project so for this again go to the maven repository and search for test ng and scroll down and below you find the dependencies for test ng copy these dependencies and go to your projects and pom.xml file in between the two tags you can paste here and click on save to verify the test ng dependencies go to maven repository and find the jar files for test ng if not present then again go to project click on build automatically and then you will get this jar files in maven repository so as this way we can add the different dependencies uh, as of now uh, we add the selenium java and test engine dependencies in our projects 
now in the next step we can add the browsers and write the basic scripts for execution so let's start it so for adding the browsers we need to know what browser version you are using so for this click on these three dots help and about google chrome and here your browser version is appearing so note down this version and now go to the your browser and search for google chrome download and now click on the first link then you are redirected to the drivers page and check and verify here what version you are using and accordingly download it and now the zip file get downloaded so first upon all unzip it go to your executable files so here we need to copy this path and paste it in our program so to copy the path we using a unique technique so for this uh, first upon all hold the shift button then right click then copy as path so now we copied this path and we need to paste it in our programs now we can write a program so first upon all create a class to create a class right click on package then new then class and give any name and then select main methods and finish now to add the browser we are using the set property methods for set property methods into bracket use the key comma value so here key is equal to webdriver dot chrome dot driver and value is nothing but the path of our executable files so already we copied and pasted here okay if you are using the windows then in the path dot exe required now we will create the object for drivers so here web driver driver is equal to new chrome driver so here driver object has the access to the methods of chrome driver which are defined in web driver interface so this expression we will see details in next video so here we are using the few methods uh, to execute the first programs so we are using here get methods here we can use the url and driver dot get uh, whatever the url paste it here now we can use the get title get current url and close methods these methods are discussed detail in next video so as of now we have created one basic code for execution now we can execute our program so this one is the last step so click on run so as for our script uh, we entered the url of youtube.com first upon all it will open the youtube.com url then we get the title of our page then get the current url and then close method close the window so this will be the complete executions for our current script or this program so friends as this way we have successfully created the maven project and executed a basic programs